liver cells produce 75 to 100 grams of protein per day. Your liver will make the protein it needs. You don't need to focus on getting protein from foods. I know that's a big thing, and we've probably talked about that over and over again. So many people are like, but how much protein should I get? Where am I getting your protein? Your liver makes the protein you need, you need because your eyelashes need different proteins. Your hair needs different proteins. You know, your heart needs different proteins. Your salivary glands needs different proteins. Your body needs to make those type of proteins. You cannot get them from specific foods. Spirulina is one of the most heavy protein dense foods on the planet, but also because it's got so many amino acids. These are the building blocks so that your body can build the protein it needs. You're, only, you're going to only get two types of proteins from food um, that your body needs. You have to have the amino acids to build the other hundreds and hundreds of different proteins that the body needs. You've got to get them from amino acids. So again, 95% of the blood protein is produced in the liver. So again, in order for your body to do that, you have to have amino acids. So as I was reading through this the other day, I thought, I don't think we hit home enough. I want you guys as foot sewners to know how important amino acids is. Because one thing we do with foot sewing is we go back to the basics. How is, the, how is your communication system working? How is your grid? How is your organs talking to each other? Where's the root cause of the problem? And a lot of times it could be just bring in amino acids, get in some wholesome foods, get in some water and some sunshine. Beautiful things happen in the body. Our bodies are made to heal. You know this. It has an innate ability to do that. What is impeding it? What is it not being given so that it can do its job? So again, I want to remind you how important amino acids is. And you can